Hi everyone, this is me. My name's Marjorie, and I'm Rainbow Playmaker. I filmed this beautiful intro for you, but it turned out a little not to my liking. So I decided I would just do a voiceover instead. If you're new to my channel, welcome, and I hope you really consider subscribing and hitting that bell, smashing that notification, joining the big <laughs> Oh well, you know what I mean. I'm sure you know what I mean. Thank you to these wonderful Rainbow Squad Rainbow Fam members. If you would like to be featured in one of my videos, all you have to do is hashtag Rainbow Squad or hashtag Subby in the comment section and be subscribed to my channel and have that bell turned on. In today's video, I am going to show you how to make three different types of slimes. The slimes all kind of build upon each other, so you're really making one slime, but in the process you're making three slimes, if that makes any sense at all. So we're going to start by making a cloud creamish type slime and then we will turn that into a cloud slime and then we will turn that into my OG cloud butter slime. So make sure you watch the entire video so you can get my tips and tricks on how to make the best slimes possible. Now let's do this. Yeah! Now these bottles are five ounce and the white are only four ounce, so I'm going to leave a little clear glue in there. Then I'm going to mix it up and I'm going to activate. Now I know I'm gonna get a lot of questions asking me if, I, if you could just use white glue or if you could just use clear glue. For this, you can actually, because we are turning it into my OG cloud butter slime and so yeah, it will work. It's just you all asked how I like to make mine and this is how I make mine. But you can make it with just white or clear glue. I would probably recommend, um, it's a little different texture depending if you go either white or clear glue, but they're both really, really nice. Now the reason I like adding the clear glue is because that is what adds the sizzle. There's a little sizzle that is added to cloud slimes when you use a clear glue base. You get it a little with the white glue too, just not as much. I'm activating with half a teaspoon of borax dissolved in water. In case you're wondering. Now it is okay to slightly overactivate your slime if you want to or if you accidentally do it because once we add the snow, that will kind of undo that a little bit. Here I'm adding one tablespoon of expanding snow and I'm mixing it in. Once it's all mixed in, it will give you a cloud creamish kind of texture. And then when we add even more snow to it, it will turn into a cloud slime.
I'm adding one pump of foam soap just because I like adding foam soap to all of my slimes, but this is definitely not a necessary ingredient. So the only other step is to add some Daiso Play. You can add any color that you like. Um, and actually, no, that's not good. I need to break it because I normally only do big batches. So for this amount, I think you only need maybe a quarter of the, a quarter of it. So let's see how it turns out and I'll decide if I need some more. You can make it as buttery as you want by adding more clay. Or you can make it more cloudy by adding less clay. So it's up to you. In my shop reviews, I've had uh, reviews both ways where people were like, I wish it was more buttery or I wish it was more cloudy. So it just depends. It's a personal preference. Um, so yeah, so you can just decide as you're doing it. Just add a little clay at first and then add a little more. And you can see the texture is just super light and soft and fluffy, like a real cloud. So the only other thing that I do for my Ballerina Pink Butter Cloud or Cloud Butter from my shop is add glitters. So this is the texture. Just like a spreadable and soft cloud slime. It doesn't drip the same way as like a regular cloud would, um, but it still has like a nice fluff and stretch to it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you being here. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Can't wait to see me until my next video. Check me out on all other forms of social media. I'm Rainbow Playmaker everywhere. See you next time.